morning, we want to introduce you to some artwork that's making a difference. It's called the Twigs Program, and middle school students who participated now have their art on display. Allison Brown is joining us live with more. Hey, Allison, describe this whole program to us. Good morning. It's great to be here. Yes, this is a um, after school and Saturday program that the Baltimore School for the Arts offers to about 700 Baltimore City children. They study art, uh, visual arts, dance, music, theater production, and we're really excited to have the student artwork displayed here in our lobby at the University of Maryland Medical Center Midtown campus. So how were the pieces of artwork chosen? Oh, my goodness. I, uh, they were chosen by the director of the visual arts program at Twigs, Archie Veal, and uh, his associates who work in the school and uh, run that, the visual arts program for 6th, 7th, and 8th graders. Some pretty talented kids there. Oh my goodness, the, the work is really impressive. It's amazing. We had a reception here earlier in the week with the kids and their families, and our staff, our patients and families, our visitors love seeing this artwork displayed throughout the hospital. And how long will it be on display? It's going to be up here in our lobby through the um, June 8th and also in some of our first floor hallways. All right, excellent, I Allison. think they're probably uh, 200 people. Yes. Oh, no, I was just going to say thank you so pieces? much for joining us. And 200 pieces, that's a lot to take a look at. Thank you, Allison. Well, there's a proposed rate increase for Maryland's health insurance. So coming up, we'll tell you what it could mean for you.